While proposed changes to Sarasota County's comprehensive plan are still being reviewed, efforts are underway to stop some of them. The plan is used by county officials to determine the community's goals for development. ABC 7's Bo Beth Yates joins us now with a follow-up. Bo Beth. Well, while the county attempts to amend the comprehensive plan, one resident wants to amend the charter, which could prevent some of the changes from taking effect. 81 different changes are being proposed to Sarasota County's comprehensive plan, but some argue that the changes could have negative impacts on everything from historic preservation to the environment. The comprehensive plan has been beaten to submission lately. Among the concerns, this amendment, which would delete the word all from the directives, which states the county should identify, manage, and protect all ecological communities and native habitats. Without the word all, some worry the environmental consequences could be great. And that's just one of the many changes causing concern. The wording in the comprehensive plans that previously said shall, which is very definitive, now says should. The county has given away sections of our roads when the comp plan says that they shall not do so. So certainly if it says that they should not do so, it's open game. Sarasota resident Mike Cosentino has taken his concerns to the next level, drafting an amendment to the county's charter, which would supersede some of the changes to the comprehensive plan. The right. charter amendment that I filed actually takes the language of 1.1.13 that has been changed and to give the voters a chance to put into the county charter the language that was gutted. Cosentino still has to gather the necessary signatures to get his initiative on the November ballot. In the meantime, county officials stress the possible changes to the plan are necessary to prepare for future growth. It is our plan for how we get to a kind of a better future for Sarasota County. It's all about our quality of life, how we spend our resources, how we coordinate with one another, and the things that are important to us. Parsons is the county's planning manager, and he stresses those with concerns still have time to get involved with the process. It is uh, the community's plan. It is the community's intention for how we're going to grow. So uh, the community is absolutely invited to take a look. Now the county is waiting to hear back from the state about the proposed changes to the comprehensive plan. A second vote and public hearing on the matter is expected in October.